Hi, I'm Tony Gagne from HB Tuners. I'm the sales manager for Ford Gas. We're on Hot Rod Power Tour 2024. We have our media van here, and the media van needs a little step up, a little more pep to the pedal there. So we decided to do something about it. But one of the things we figured out is that the shifting is not what we want. It's got that skip shift to it. We want to take care of that. So we're going to take care of it today for you and show you how to do it. Let's get started. Hi, right, we've already read this file. And we're gonna take a look at what I was talking about. If you look at the transmission shift pattern, you're gonna notice some really odd numbers. So specifically like on the first or second gear, you can see 3000 RPM right there between 425 and 305 on the output shaft speed. Now obviously that's gonna make it go into the skip shift where you notice one to three right here. So we're gonna go ahead and correct that. And the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna use the interpolate button. So we're gonna come right up in here and we're gonna go from the 425 up to the, we'll say the 590 number, all right here. And we're gonna interpolate it. All right, so that just changed the shift, made it nice and smooth at that point. But it still would use the first, the third. So we're gonna take that out of the system. We'll make that 5,000, set it up in that. Now we're gonna look at the next one. This looks good. And now we have a third to fourth with a skip shift here. So we're gonna take a look at that right now. So we're gonna modify that. We go here like 680 to the 2020. We'll hit the interpolate button to make it nice and smooth. And we're gonna take this one and go 5,000 here. What we're doing is we're taking out that skip shift function end point. So fourth to fifth, you notice we got the same thing. Again, we're gonna bring it up to this, interpolate it for a nice smooth shift pattern and move the fourth to sixth skip shift, 5,000 RPM. Now we have a nice shift pattern without the skip shift. So we tested this out on the van this week. Results were, everybody loved it. They loved the way it shifts. Now, there's one other thing I wanna do this besides the skip shift and I'm gonna show you right now. So we're gonna go in there on the converter stuff. We're gonna go over to the torque converter and we're gonna look at the apply release. Apply release uses a slip map. So with that being said, it's the base. So what we're gonna do on this van between first and fifth, we're gonna set it up to 7190. And then on the downshift, which is the unlock, we're gonna set this up to 7170. So now with that, we're not gonna lock the converter first through fifth gear. We're gonna have no a skip shift on it. So it'll go from gear to gear to gear. And just so you know, we tested this this week. We picked up 1.5 miles to the gallon and it worked like a champ. This is how you correct that skip shift function when you're doing the 10 speed transmissions.